Here we go. Okay. Hi, everybody. It is Monday, February 18th. <laughs> Hold on. Let me get the lighting right. It's my good side. Actually, it's not my good side. Can you see? It's like my teen years again. I got two pimples. Um, anyway. Hi, everybody. Hi, Terry. Hi, Jeanette. Hi, Andy. Hi, Kay. Kay! I was going to say hi to you tonight and say, you know, hope you're enjoying your coffee in the morning. Uh, 6,800 stopped by. What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> okay, don't tell me that. I'm, I'm going to have to pat up or something. <laughs> well, welcome, all 6,800 of you. <laughs> What? I don't know. Where do I read this? Andy, I rely on you to have all the stats. I don't look at them. Don't even say that. I'm not joking. I'm sweating now. Okay. Bottom left. Oh, I don't know. I haven't turned all off. I don't want to see anything. I actually don't. Oh, don't tell me that. Oh, my God. All right. And I don't have a list or anything. Okay. That's fine by me. Let's... <laughs> Okay, so let's start. It is February 18th. I hope you all had a wonderful Valentine's Day. And um, I, oh, Lori's got a commercial. I want to welcome everybody here um, because it just gets bigger and bigger every week. And I don't get it, and I love it, and I feel humbled that anybody would join us. The format of the show is there is no format. There are no rules. There is little to no prep. I I just go as we as I feel. And sometimes it leads to wonderful things. And sometimes I wish I never would have hit the record button. So, uh, but that's okay. I never watch back my shows. I never watch back any demonstrations or videos I've done, even when I go to CHA, I never watch them and somebody says to me, oh, you got to see this. You were nice or you were good. I, mm -mm. So I make sure that I um, do not watch them. Uh, and there's a reason for that. I would never show up the next week. So anyway, uh, my mom and dad are here. At least I see my dad. He just announced it's wine 30. And that is the bell to yes. You may go grab your beverage of choice. It could be tea. It could be wine. Um, oh, I usually have my mug here. But I don't need to wear my mug because guess what? I got an apron. Look. Okay. So for those of you who like two shows ago said we need an apron, I made an apron that night. And I ordered it and I put it online and we have an apron. So it just says Mixed Media Mondays, my logo, do something creative every day because that's my saying. And um, I love it. It has pockets. And I put it on my website today if um, Andy can give a link to that. It has two giant pockets. So you could put a bottle of beer or your paint, look at your paint brushes or, I don't know, chapstick, whatever you guys need. <laughs> no, I did not sew this. I found an outside company to do this. My sewing days, yeah, it's long. So if you like to um, craft in the buff, uh, it will protect you, Sandy. 100% protection. Um, yeah, bottle of beer, anything you want, um, you know. Uh, uh, anyway, if it, I'm excited because it fits your paintbrushes. See, if I were, oh, look at it, need a paintbrush. Okay. Anyway, I do stick stuff in my pockets and I wash them. So anyway, tonight my goal is to get rid of my OCD and to not be worried about getting paint on this because you guys have no idea how many clothes I've ruined on Monday night. I believe showing up not in my, my regular crafting clothes, which would be braless with my pajamas. It doesn't look professional. And let me tell you, the camera adds, adds about 10 pounds of sag. And as much as I need help in that area, I don't need help for it if it goes south. So anyway, now I have an apron that is supportive. <laughs> is Sandy acting up already? Ay, ay, ay. Andy, Andy and Mary, I 
heavy moderating her. Oh my God, my dad's going to order her apron. Dad, please, the thought of you woodworking in the buff is enough to send me to the moon and back. Anyway, um, <laughs> so anyway, large, <laughs> Sandy says she's being good. So that's the big news. If you, if Andy can give the link to my website, I took my, had my daughter take a picture of me today where I was like modeling it and I look really horrendously tired, but I'm not. Okay. I, I, you guys, I like try, I want to be chatting anyway. Oh yeah, this would be good in your wood shop. Yeah, this would be good in your wood shop. And it's form fitting. It makes you look very slim. <laughs> Um, okay, so that covers the aprons. Now, I want to talk about February challenge. Please upload your layouts. It's, uh, I don't remember what the February challenge is, but I, the creative dare, but I remember it's something having to do with your dreams. It's, I think it's this. So this, oh, that's not my dream. My dream is not to be a butterfly, but I think I'd make a cute one. Uh, this was, you know, this is my dreams journal. And lately I've been working really hard to kind of, um, concentrate on, oh, oops, the cover stuck to my, okay. So if, yeah, lifeless, bucket list. If you don't have one, get one. That's my assignment for you too. Jean, I hope you're working on yours. And it can be one item at a time. Please do not feel possessed that you have to add 42 items at a time because that's not the way it works, okay? Oh, good. Anna found the crackle. Oh, Anna's on the crack now. This is what happens when you get on the crack. Um, okay. Uh, the coaster swap is complete. I mailed them all out last night at 1030. And let me tell you, here are my, I, I, I was in all three groups. These are the works of art. And I'm going to share every single one of them on my website. I, I'm going to share every one of mine. Mine were not matching and I made 30 of them. And I'm teaching a class in this now. So this little idea has really grown wings. And they're amazing. These are four by four coasters. Uh, trust me, right now, the last thing I want to see is another coaster. I sorted 30 of these bad boys, and I loved every minute of it. Mary, you're coming over next one for the next one. So this was our swap, and there were there were three groups. I just I put them all together last night because I wanted to. They're amazing. They're utterly amazing. Thanks, mom. I'll send you one. The they are. All amazing. And uh, I will share these all. I'm thinking on the next day or so because I already have the blog post ready to go. I just need to finish the slideshow. And I want to show all of them. These are so cute. And what a great way to, like, give your art to somebody. There you go. Oh. Um, and we're going to do another swap soon. And for those of you who sent me thank you cards... I mean, thank you so much. And thank you, canvases. They're all going up on my wall. And, oh, Angie, isn't it cute? It says, it's hugs. I love that. And this is, I think this is Allie. Allie, they're all beautiful. I, I, I love to organize the swap. I, I don't love to sort them. Actually, I hate sorting them. But um, I love being the conduit by which we come together and share our art. And for those of you who... Mickey's FaceTiming now, and, I, and, she, and she's also watching TV, and I told, and, I, and she paused it, yeah. and the volume's on, like, zero. Yes. Anything else? Um, so Go ahead. Is there, she, any, is there anything else bothering you? Tell her to, like, either turn it up or give me the remote. Yeah. Mickey, get off FaceTime. Okay, Joey, you got anything else? Because, I mean, we're not doing anything here. We're just hanging out. Just hanging out. Okay, so I'm a mom, and I have three of them. <sighs> okay, so um, anyway, uh, the coaster swap was a huge success, and I'm so... <laughs> okay. <laughs> no. 
No problems, Dad. I'm so fine. I love. Oh, hold on. Nikki's not doing it. Okay. If I have one more interruption, your bedtime tomorrow night, seven o'clock. It's gonna be rough. Turn it up, Michaela. Oh, thank God I put a lock on my French door. Okay. Uh, all right. Oh, Mary Kay, I think I just I, I think I just showed your canvas. Thank you. Okay. Oh, you want to see the apron? <laughs> well, here's the apron. <laughs> okay. So, uh, I'm sorry. You get what you pay for, and I, I don't know if you guys noticed. Your show is free, and I have to be a mom, too. That's awesome. Uh, I do a, you mean a twirl? You should do a twirl. Ready? Woo. Okay. And it has pockets, big pockets. And it makes you look chesty, which for me is a nice thing. Okay. All right, we're done. <laughs> twirl like girl. Okay. All right, so here's my apron, and I am not getting anything on this. Okay, so I want to talk about a couple of things, and then we're going to just start rolling. I um, I had a great weekend. I had a phenomenal weekend, and intermi intermixed with that, if you guys are women, many of you are, dad, company excluded. Uh, I told this story, and I'm going to go really quick. Uh, 40 years old, never cried Turn 40, all of a sudden, the ducks are just pouring out. So this weekend, I um, I have to tackle a lot. I have three kids. I have a house. I have a studio. I have business. I run. I have a life, which is probably a very small section of the pie. <laughs> Here's all the other stuff, and the life part is this part. And um, so when we get to the weekend, I work hard so that I can literally play hard. And uh, a lot of people, and I talk to a lot of my friends, especially if you're a mom, you have no balance. You volunteer, you're on the PTA, you're the yes girl. You, uh, oh yes, you need 25 copies of that, I'm your girl. You need 42,000 sequins glued onto something, I'm your girl. You need this, I'm your girl. And then you get to the weekend and you're like, I have to mow the lawn. I, well, many of you don't have to mow the lawn, but I have to mow the lawn. I have to go to Costco. I have to, legally, I have to feed the kids, I found out. CPS frowns if you don't. So, no, I'm teasing. <laughs> and um, I have a lot on my plate. And this weekend was gorgeous. And I have tried to put my life back in this place of balance. No, I will not sew 42,000 sequins on anything. No, you may not use my computer to make a copy because I don't want you over my house. No, I don't want to keep the books as the treasure anymore because my kids could care less if there is 42 cents in the PTA account. I gave my time um, a lot to the point where I gave so much of my time, I never had me time. And I think a lot of us do that. And, and then it, you get to a point where you just have to go, I cannot do that anymore. So anyway, I went to Costco this weekend and uh, long story short, had my phone and credit card because I mom didn't want to leave my purse in the cart because my mom goes ballistic that my purse is going to be stolen and left my credit card in my pocket, took my phone out of my pocket, responded to the whatever was going on at home and dropped my credit card right before I went up, unloaded my groceries. The guy behind me was upset because I couldn't find my credit card and it all went to hell in a handbasket in 8.2 minutes. And I started crying in Costco. They loaded my stuff back up. The long of the short is, I also had a lot of female hormones happen another time. Uh, they found, my credit card was found, and it was okay. And I got back in line. Uh, I got back in line. I will moderate you. Um, I want to thank our moderators, which are um, Scrap and Andy. Oops. And um, Mary, I hope Mary is still moderator. I mean, I don't know if she is. I'm looking for you, Scrap and Andy. A lot of people on. Anyway, um, so I lost it. Okay, I cannot find you, Andy. Why can't I find you? Because there's a lot of people here. Oh, there you are. Okay, hopefully that'll work. Hopefully that'll work. Okay, good. Okay. 
yeah, it worked out for me. And I, I just have come to this place in my life where I'm so grateful for everything I have that when something doesn't work out, it's not the end of the world. But you maybe should have told me when I was standing at Costco with tears running down my eyes and I was embarrassed. But um, out of that came this. I was driving home and I said, I'm feeding these kids and I need, I need an hour of their time. I need, if you guys have kids too, this helps, but I have a dog too. So she went too. I need one hour of their time. I texted all of them and said, I need one hour of your time. Wear tennis shoes, um, put shorts on. It's nice out. Don't ask me any questions. Do not complain. I just want you for one hour and they all thought they were going to do yard work and I got home and I said I've had a really bad day help me unload everything and out of that time came a hike we went hiking for three miles in a local um I gotta close my window and a local reserve and um I realized that um as as rough as that and the day before my lawnmower wouldn't start as rough as those things were, um, I was downright blessed to come from a place of yes to the things that I want to be doing on the weekend. So I want to put in my dreams book, I'm going to put the words yes, Y-E-S. I don't know how I'm going to put them, but here they are. <laughs> I haven't gotten to the how we're going to put them on. Um so I, uh, I, I, uh, I just wanted to share that you have to really decide what is worth saying yes to in your life. A lot of people say they don't, um, they don't have a lot of time to craft or they don't have a lot of time for their kids and their family. And I have work and I have this and I have that. And sometimes I used to find myself at soccer games going, what's happening around me? I turn my cell phone off. I turn Facebook off. I um, I want to go to a soccer game and be there 100% for my kids, even when they're not playing. <laughs> and I'm sitting there going, come on, you know, put my kid in. Um, and I felt sorry for myself on Sunday that the weather was so beautiful. And I had one friend who was off doing this and another friend who was doing this. And I looked on Facebook and I said, the whole world is having fun but me. And um, I decided that the lawnmower wouldn't start. I got my credit card. I needed one hour of my kids. And I needed, uh, and it was great. I mean, they, you should see the beginning of the hike. They're like this, you know, checking their text messages. And, uh, but eventually all three of them along the trail. And if Andy could give you the link, I shared my pictures along the trail each one of them came to me individually, and I talked to my 15-year-old, I talked to my two 11-year-olds, and I eventually talked to the dog. And it was kind of like, wow, I haven't talked to these people, and I live with them. So, oh, and I talked to a snake. There was a snake along the way, and the kids were all, like, so disengaged. And this minute that snake passed by, and I go, hey, guys, snake. It was like, oh, forget the... Um, so if you don't have those moments in your life, you may be saying yes to the wrong stuff. Okay? So keep that in mind. And I am putting in my dreams book tonight, yes. But I'm saying yes to work my ass off Monday through Friday. But come Friday, in that mix of still going to Costco and meeting the demands of my family, I do have come from a place of yes for me. And that's why I want to put yes in my dreams book. Does that make sense? Does everybody want to just fall asleep right now? <laughs> I hope to go. There's still people tuned in. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. And I, I don't have a plan other than, yes, there's my plan. There is no plan. And I want to work in some vivid colors. I, I'm going to try some reds, some hot pinks, and some teal. Absolutely makes sense. Oh, good. Okay, wait a minute. Terry says no. <laughs> no on the sleep. Um, yes and no. Okay. Oh, if you could put a link to my hike. I think it's, I think I posted it yesterday. And if you guys have a moment. No teal. Oh, no teal. <laughs> I'm like, no, I don't understand. Okay. Uh, I, I don't know why I'm just going to choose to 
let me just grab a few colors. And I don't know why I said red, but I said it, so I'm going to go with it. I don't think I, we have any moderators. Well, Lori, I'm making you. What is going on with my moderation? Okay, Lori, you're now a moderator because I need moderators. And somebody has to be able to decipher these questions for me. Okay, for those of you who are new to the show, my prep work was zero. Uh, I just told you a story of me crying, and that's just how it went. And, okay, that is, she is moderator there. And I don't know where Mary is. Did Mary leave us? Okay. Oh, Lamar, I just told the whole story, Lamar. Okay. Okay, Mary and I are not moderators. I think you are now. Hold on. Let me make... Oh, I don't know what's going on. I'm trying. There's a lot of people logged in. Okay, you are moderator. You are moderator. You are moderator. And I don't know about Mary. I'm trying, people. If you guys see, it helps me if I don't have 82 moderators because I have to be able to see the questions. <laughs> okay. Is there, are there any questions? Mayor and I are not moderated. I think I got it. Did I fix it? I hope so. Oh, scrap and Andy that one. All right. Well, that's his D mod, so I don't know. Okay. <laughs> With the snake, the snake bothers you guys. I love that the snake bothers everybody. It doesn't bother me. I don't know why. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start with a. Snakes don't bother me, especially when I, it wasn't a rattlesnake. You know, we have rattlesnakes around here, and I'm pretty astute to rattlesnakes. So, uh, you know, I don't want, I obviously don't want a rattlesnake crossing my path. But, so, yeah, there we go. There was my my weekend hike, and I made time for friends to come over. And, you know, I, if you guys are getting to the weekends and you are 100% burned out before you even get there, you really got to make some time for your weekend to just re regenerate. Go in your studio. Okay, Mary says something. She's saying. <laughs> She's trying. Mary's trying. Okay. Mary's trying. Okay. So, uh. <laughs> I cannot believe you guys are going nuts over snakes. I put that on my Facebook page and everybody went nuts. And I'm like, oh, they're so good. You don't realize how great snakes are. They really are good. Okay. Oh, my dad. My dad would. No. You're good, dad. Oh. I know. Um, Andy, I'm having problems with modding and demodding you as well. I don't know why. So you're kind of off the list. And you know what? Let's do one more. I'm just, because I could see her name. There you go. She figured out who's, and Mary seems to be having a problem. So if you have any questions, what happens is I get going on the work. I don't really look up. It's hard for me to follow 